It is Wednesday evening yes. and we're gonna go to a liquidation store not the same one that we normally go to a different one I'm just it's like four o'clock in the afternoon so we're just gonna go and have a look and then have you join us for a mukbang we're trying to decide where we're going to have for supper all I know is we're gonna sit in the car and, and do a mukbang that's all I know yeah so Anyways, um, I didn't realize it was kids that lived there. Well, you never, you never see kids outside anymore. <laughs> no, I know. Right. There was a trampoline there. I never even seen kids. Yeah. Um, so, the other day when I pranked Kevin, he is doing incredibly well. He had been sleeping for a couple of hours and it didn't do him any harm and we laughed about it after and we were joking with Katie and Dorothy about it. It's all okay. You're still a jerk. <laughs> I had to get up anyway. It was supper. Yes. So it was all in good fun. Anybody knows that the actual pain from the actual operation decision I don't have any anymore like no. it's gone yeah. yeah he's not limping his foot's not dropping he's doing amazing you know had it been a week ago no I wouldn't have pulled that prank on him not at all no. <laughs> so yeah, anyways and then we're our daughter Hannah who is Famous oh. for pulling pranks on Kevin. Yeah, she is. She used to hide around. She used to stand right in front of the bathroom door, and I would open it up, and she would scare the bejesus out of me. Yep. So she called us last night, and she's laughing her head off because she had watched the video. And I said to her, "Did I do you proud?" And she said, "You sure did." <laughs> <laughs> So, <laughs> you know, that's, we just, that's just who we are. Oh. So, what are you on about? Oh, she's yawning. Oh. <laughs> and I looked over and unfortunately you got it caught on camera. <laughs> that's okay. The only thing he's done today is an hour of physio. Other than that, he hasn't done anything. I kind of relax. Mm-hmm. I mean, he certainly isn't lifting anything heavy or anything like that. No. But anyways, so what's the temp today? I was trying to figure that out. The car says 28, but I don't know if you trust because it's sometimes off a little bit. Mm -hmm. So we'll let him, we'll let him figure it out. And is that is there humidity too? Like feels I like I don't I don't know. I can't mm. like I don't know. We'll honestly, figure it out. I can't like look at the phone. Yeah. We'll figure it out and we'll tell you later. But anyways, if we find anything at the liquidation store we'll show you that too. We'll see what happens. We're just getting out of the house for a couple of hours. Yeah. We were gonna take Brody for a mukbang, but then I decided that I didn't want to just just go out for a moment. Well, because we don't, yeah. Cause there, now you can tell us. And we don't know. Well, it's, it's 25, but that doesn't tell you the feel like. No, I meant the Fahrenheit. Oh, yeah. Uh, 77. 77. Certainly much better than it was on Sunday. <sighs> yeah. Sunday was horrible. So. Yeah, like my phone says 26, it says 25. It's like yeah. There right around the same. There's not a lot of humidity, so it's... No, not right now. So if it says 25, 26, it's probably feel like around 
Anyway, we'll meet up with you later. All right, we got our food. We went to Harvey's. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Actually, it's, okay, this is all your crap. We had a coupon for two can dine for fifteen ninety nine. Yeah, but it still costs us extra because we put. Bacon and cheese. Bacon and cheese, and Kelly got frames instead of fries. Yeah. So that's an additional charge, which is fine. It's still, ain't two of us. It, it's like twenty three bucks. Yeah. You can leave my burger in there. I'm gonna eat the frames first. Um, please don't do that. We'll put them in a bag then. Do you want, you got enough ketchup? Yeah. I'm limited with room here and she just dumped all this stuff <laughs> on the tray. Can't do that. I can do whatever I want. No, apparently. <laughs> According to the last video, that we <laughs> So, what I can say about that, if I was truly unhappy about what she did, it would never have made it on video. Exactly. Because I probably would have had a few choice words. <laughs> but that was not the case. <laughs> It's not the first time my family has done that to me. Yes, mm -hmm. I know. Post off and everything, but it was fine. I was already healed. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I may have bothered my sciatic a little bit, but not much. Yeah, but that's already bothering me anyway. Yeah. Kind of like you. I know. You pain in my butt. Mm -hmm. I almost said something else, but. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I didn't want to have to beep it out. <laughs> <laughs> They've changed their... Oh, their onion rings. Ah! Uh, you change them or overcook them? No, they're good. All right. Mm-hmm. They looked a little overcooked, but... No, nope, I've got them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm going to eat my burger. Burger will stay hot if that longer than these will. Yeah. <laughs> so hot why you eat fast first. I eat them both at the same time, but I have a tray. Actually, mm -hmm. here. I don't think anybody's ever seen the tray. Mm. Sorry, folks. Show you the tray. So that's the tray I put on my uh, onto the steering wheel. Here. Here's the view you my view you get <laughs> looking at the tray. It is great. It is really, really handy. Mm -hmm. um, sorry, I'm shaking everybody around here. My apologies. I'll get dizzy. And you just got it on Amazon, didn't you? Yep. Uh, I think it was like 19 bucks, 18 bucks. I can't remember. Could have been a little more. But... And we've used it a lot. Yeah. You'll see. It's funny because you'll see infomercials on them. I remember seeing infomercials on mm -hmm. them. And they wanted way too much for them. Now, get my yummy burger. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Yeah. Angus burger with bacon and cheese and ketchup, mustard, relish, and onions and pickles. Mm -hmm. This is the 
only time I get onion rings when we're out. Because you get a little of both, and I enjoy that. And the rings, yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it's like a dollar up charge. That's why I don't mind when we got the two can dine. Mm -hmm. Now they are more expensive here for the two can dine. Look at my phone. The, they have the classic burger too, which is cheaper. Yeah. But not as good. No. I find the onions just got so much better flavor. Oh, for sure. Mm. Fun fact, I worked at Harvey's when I was a teenager. Yep. I used to go see her at work. Mm -hmm. Until you quit and went over to, what was that, Mama's or Mama's Kitchen? Granny's Kitchen. Granny's Kitchen. Or Granny, yeah, Granny's. Yeah. Granny's, yeah. I don't know. It was a good place, too. Mm-hmm. Sandwiches. And, mm hmm I, They were, like, that thick. Mm-hmm. Yep. Grandma Lee's. Yes, Grandma Lee's. There mm -hmm. we go. Yeah. You did a stint at another restaurant that didn't last very long. <laughs> so in the city I grew up in, um, one of the iconic restaurants, Cosmos it was called, Family Diner. Mm -hmm. They served alcohol. And I went for my couple shifts of training. And then my first shift on my own, I had a guy that had been drinking and he got a little too much for me and I was like, yeah, I don't want to work with alcohol. Yeah. Mm-mm. Well, that's kind of why you left Harvey's too. Not that they served alcohol, but... No, but you had to deal with all the drunks late at night. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because it was downtown near the bars. Yeah. And I don't do well with that. I have no issues with people having a beverage. Nope. Even a few. It's when you become stupid that I have an issue with. If you can't handle your liquor though, mm -hmm. perhaps you shouldn't drink it. Yeah. And I know a lot of people over my over the years I've known a lot of people that are alcoholics and when they're not drinking they're amazing people mm -hmm. they just can't hold their alcohol and I have a napkin well I mean there's people that are alcoholics they would never know we're alcoholics yeah because They've drank so much over the years that it doesn't have the same effect. Now, if they blew, they would still blow over. They still technically couldn't drive. Yeah. So, for any of you that are new here, Harvey's is... Um, a Canadian fast food. Yeah. And I know um, when we've mentioned it in the past, it was a couple people had thought I said Arties, because Arties in the States, but this is Harvey's. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm. Arties or Hardies? They have both. 
Okay. Yep. Yeah. So I remember Hardy's and I, I thought we had one in Sarnia at one point. No, we had Arby's, but not No, uh, I, not know, Arby's. I know we had Arby's. Yeah. I want to say hello to I'm sorry our friend in Australia you have been so much fun in the comments she uh, her and I have been talking about how we call things different like oh yeah like we say a barbecue but they say the barbie Barbie. And um, some people, uh, the, some people in the states call it the grill. Yeah. They don't call it a barbecue. They yeah. call it grilling. Um. There was a word that she said the other day, and I had to look it up. And it was just our bell peppers, but it's what they call bell peppers. I can't. I told you, and I can't remember what the word is now. I can't remember either. <laughs> Um, in England, I think it's, I think it's an eggplant, something, but they say aubergine, and it's the same thing that, right, yeah, it's so neat to hear what different things are called around the world. Mashed potatoes and sausage, bangers and mash in England. Mm -hmm. That's a uh, British thing, but we still we eat them here a lot. Yep. Yeah. yeah, but the difference there now, I do know some places mm -hmm. are starting to cook a little more healthier. Mm -hmm. I deep. I don't know how much it is now, so please, anybody from England, don't get a. Um, and let us, let us don't know. be offended, but let us know. Mm -hmm. But they were very famous for deep frying a lot of things. We had a neighbor years ago. Yeah. Right. That was a born and raised, and childhood. Yeah. And then came to Canada, and. She said they deep fry everything, and I was like, that's yeah. strange. She like, would. Like, um, excuse me, <laughs> lady, you're going the wrong way through the drive through <laughs> Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Squirrel moment, folks. Anyways. You know what? We can put the clip of that, what we were talking about, because you got, oh, no, you don't have your camera on. Yeah, I do. It was going. Oh, cool. It was going. So... As we just talked about that, I'll have it. I'll have what we're talking about in the in the frame there. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. I'll just put it down in the corner. I've never seen that before. Me neither. Never. Anyways, um, so they deep like anything they can deep they deep fry like hot dogs, bacon, deep so fried bacon, know. eggs. Let us know. Cause That's how she was raised. Mm -hmm. But let us know. Any of our viewers here from England. Um, did you do it? Still, Do you still do it? Um, you don't do it anymore. And I also heard that your restaurants don't do refills on beverages on soda and stuff. oh yeah somebody mentioned that in one of the comments yeah yeah like all of our restaurants are free refills but they charge for it <laughs> some places it's getting up to four dollars for a pop in the restaurant yeah three something and then but then it's unlimited yeah but 
And who can drink that much? And, and they're making they, money off it. They bring it without even you asking. Mm -hmm. They, they are have making, a sit-down restaurant. They are making money off the of fountain pop. Mm -hmm. Because it, I mean, it's not. I want to say it's pennies for a cup. It's, it's more than that, but it's definitely not the price that they charge mm -hmm. you. Yeah. Now, if you go to a restaurant where they serve only cans, you don't get refills. No. No. But that's far and few between these days. Most places have have fountain. Yeah. Oh, this is so good and I really want to eat it all. <laughs> want more fries? You want more burger? I'll switch you. Okay, yeah, I'd sooner. Can I have ketchup though? Serious? I have ketchup on very few things. His sister wouldn't sit at our breakfast table unless it was ketchup on the table. <laughs> I just need one. I know, and I'm trying to get it without getting it all <laughs> yucky because I've already put garbage in there. People call me a garbage picker now. I don't even know if I can eat all of this. <laughs> sure, you can. It's only a few bites. No, I can't. <laughs> They're amazing burgers. And anybody that has that, that doesn't eat meat, they do have a plant-based burger. <laughs> I've never tried it because I don't eat that stuff, but it looks nice. Oh, that was yummy. Mm -hmm. It'd be fun to do some research and do a video on different words that people like, what people call different things. Yeah. That'd be fun. I know the one I always found confusing growing up. Because mm -hmm. you park on a driveway mm -hmm. and you drive on a highway or a parkway. <laughs> Car park? Yeah. Parking lot? <laughs> yeah. Like, like what we know as a driveway should be a parkway. Because <laughs> you park. I have Yep, as soon as I do something with this. There you go. <coughs> or we say laneway. Yes, we do. Yeah. Well, yes, but people Older west, folks used out to. people, if you say laneway, they're going to think you mean the back alleyway and not you're actually where you park your vehicle because that they're actually called laneways. Yes, but down in southern Ontario where we grew up, the older oh, yeah. people used to say laneway. Laneway, yeah. 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 All right. Well, I, I know one, like, we call them trucks. In England, they call them lorries. <laughs> I have no idea how you got, how they yeah, ever got that. Yeah, I don't know what that. that means. I don't know what that means. Well, a lorry is a truck, but I, I don't... know, but I don't know how they got that word. Like, yeah. <laughs> well, you know what it means. You just don't know. And there's a bicyclist <laughs> going through the drive-through the wrong way. <laughs> Apparently, it's uh, go the wrong way day. <laughs> okay. That's fun. <laughs> that is it. And if I remember, if I remember, you've seen the car going. 
Oh, you'll remember. Because I'll <laughs> make sure, you. He shall remind me. Um, but we'll meet you at home and show you what we got at that liquidation store. It's not much. It's not much. Just little things, but. Yeah. All right. All we'll right. meet you at home. Okay. All right. You want to say hi to everybody, bro? Say, hi. I know there's something on that table for me. Me. Wow. <laughs> okay, so we went to what is it called? Bianca's. Bianca Armor's liquidation. <laughs> <laughs> he knows he's not allowed to actually get on the table, so he's like. <laughs> Apparently, he can smell these. Kind of. Oh, what? <laughs> What? Open, what? Daddy. Open. Open, Daddy. Are those good? Okay. <laughs> How much were they? They were a dollar ninety nine. Hmm. Yeah. And they're turkey, duck, and quail flavors. Something like that, yeah. Mm. Okay. Um, I don't know. Kelly got this for her back. It's five bucks. What else did you get? Uh, this mold that was two dollars. Mm -hmm. These um, horrible. They were two ninety nine. That's a big bag too. Mm hmm. Uh, and then skinny pop popcorn. Gingerbread cookie flavor. Um, I'm trying to look for the price here. Oh, 99 cents. <laughs> Gingerbread, ugh. Rice, salsa, cake flavors, $1.99. And these were $1.50. 1976. And then after supper, I was like, I want to go to the Ridge. Of course. So she got these for Gurdon's. I've never bought actually, um, their Yves Rocher. Yves Rocher, which we used for, to comes out of Montreal. Yeah. I used to always. Um, I don't even know if they them. exist anymore. Yeah, they do. Oh. Yep. Yeah, $3.99. Yeah, but they don't have a lot of stores. Not stores, yeah. online. Yeah. Yeah, I've been looking. And I don't normally buy this kind of stuff at Value Village, but it's still sealed. That's why I did. So, yeah. I don't even know if that's just something that somebody put on there. Or... No, that's how they seal them. Is it? Okay. Yep. Yep. So that total, we got a dollar off. I had a dollar there. Uh, 733. Mm -hmm. Well, bro. You made a quick appearance in the video today, huh? I did. Guess what, Brody? Mummy and Daddy had a mukbang in the car with french fries. Without you. But we brought you treats to suck up. <laughs> All right, we'll see you on the next video. Bye. Yesterday